they want to call us greedy. They got the whole thing backwards. What would you say to the CEOs of these auto companies that say uh, the, the union has not been acting in good faith, that there were delays? What, what do you make of that? Let's talk about what good faith is. They've had our economic demands for six weeks. We've told them from day one, we expect a bargain now, not wait till the end. They waited till last week. We had to file unfair labor practice charges on two companies to get them to come to the table. So they waited till the last week to want to get down to business. Shame on them, and what they're saying is complete BS. You heard the CEO of Ford say that it would bankrupt them if they met your demands. What would you think of that? I think it's a joke. You know what? They could double our pay right now. Labor, the cost of labor the co that goes into a vehicle is 5% of the vehicle. They could double our wages, and they could not raise the price of vehicles, and they would still make billions of dollars. It's a lie like everything else that comes out of their mouth. The strategy, the strategy, the strategy is three facilities. What impact do you think that could make on the auto industry as a whole across we'll this country? We'll find out. And you know what? And it's going to keep on building if they don't come to the table for our members. Last question. More facilities are going to, are more facilities going to feel this? Are more facilities going on strike? If they don't, if they don't take care of our members, they will. So we tell them we are the union. We are the union. Mighty, mighty union. Mighty, mighty union. All the work is union. All the work is union. As kick